How can the diocese teach Catholics about transubstantiation? That's taught in our parish schools and in our religious education programs. It wasn't taught very well for a number of decades. The books are much better now. Most Catholics are not aware that the bread and wine become the body and blood of Christ. I'm not sure that's true. When I go around, I get the impression that people know that here is the body of Christ, sacramentally present, really present, body and blood, soul and divinity. If we could get that word out, mass attendance would increase. Maybe, but we're tremendously preachers of habit. And when you lose the habit of going to daily mass, or Sunday mass, rather, uh, it's hard to get it back again. You have to keep inviting people to come along. In the, in the Arts Ass and Pastoral Council last time we met, that's 60 lay people, three of whom are teenagers. They're elected by their groups, by their deaneries. I heard for the first time a complaint from the three teenagers, we can't get our parents to go to church. I was really glad to hear that. It means maybe the catechesis is taking. Usually I hear the opposite. Parents, and especially grandparents, say we can't get our children to go to church. So maybe there's a generational shift here. And um, the middle generation that might not have been too well catechized has to do some catching up.